The U.S. offshore wind industry has been hampered by environmental concerns and rising installation costs. But a project in Portugal may have found a solution to those problems. Back in 2020, Windflowed Atlantic developed the world's first semi-submersible wind farm, located a little over 12 miles off the Portuguese coast. The facility consists of three floating platforms, each with a turbine on a board that can be raised and lowered as needed in changing water levels, with the whole structure being anchored to the sea floor so it remains in place, even in the face of severe weather. These partially submerged turbines can be 50% cheaper to build than their monopile foundation counterparts. They're also reportedly better for the surrounding ecosystem, with surveys finding semi-submerged wind farms help foster undersea conservation efforts and the formation of coral reefs. Additionally, these facilities are producing energy at a much better rate than experts had previously forecasted. Since the wind farm in Portugal came online, it has blown past previous electrical output projections during its first four years of operation. The wind farm now provides enough energy to annually power 25,000 homes, while also removing about 33,000 tons of carbon dioxide from the atmosphere, an emissions total equivalent to taking nearly 8,000 gasoline engine cars off the road for a year. To get more stories about renewable energy technology, download the Strain Aero News app and sign up for alerts from me, Jack Almer.